Did you know that we are already in the midst of a climate crisis that could completely transform our lives as we know them? This isn't a looming possibility. No, it's an ongoing shift occurring faster than even our most astute scientists predicted. The climate crisis we're grappling with is a multifaceted, self-perpetuating process. The culprits, greenhouse gases, relentless deforestation, and unsustainable human practices. These factors are triggering swift alterations in our environment, pushing Earth's natural systems beyond their capacity to adjust. Once we cross certain thresholds, this crisis could self-propel, dependent on a web of interconnected and fragile factors. Adding to the gravity of the situation is the uncertainty surrounding potential side effects. Climate changes could blindside us with unforeseen complications and domino effects. We could face disruptions in global food production due to erratic weather patterns. New diseases could emerge as ecosystems shift. Regrettably, even if we implement dramatic changes immediately, we might not fully reverse these conditions. As such, it's vital that we brace ourselves for a new way of life, should our efforts to halt this crisis fall short. We could see mass migrations, shifting agricultural zones, and new weather norms. And these could be just the tip of the iceberg. When it comes to tackling this crisis, our focus should be twofold. Stopping the climate crisis in its tracks and adapting to its inevitable impacts. This calls for a multifaceted global effort from every individual, every corporation and every government. We need to transition away from fossil fuels, embrace renewable energy and intensify research into absorbing the carbon dioxide that's already in our atmosphere. To wrap up, the climate crisis is real and it's an existential threat to humanity. It calls for immediate effective global mobilization on a scale we've never seen before. We must act now and work together not only to minimize the damage, but to prepare for a fundamentally different future. The cost of inaction or even delay is simply too high. The consequence is a radical change in life as we know it. But with cooperation, dedication and sustained effort, it is a crisis we have the potential to mitigate. We have a choice. We can either be the generation that allowed our planet to perish or the one that fought to secure its future. The clock is ticking, and the time to act is now.